After a long intermission, time once again to roll out the red carpet. The 74th Cannes Film Festival is underway more than two years after its last installment. For its return, a spotlight on firsts. The first black person to head the jury for the Palme d'Or, American director Spike Lee, bringing with him a sense of outrage at racial injustice. Three decades after his breakthrough film Do the Right Thing depicted the death of a black man at the hands of police. You would think and hope that 30 some years later, the black people stop being hunted down like the animals. I'm glad to be here, though. It's also the first time women outnumber men on that jury, though they represent just four of the 24 directors vying for the Palme d'Or. I don't know if in our lifetimes we'll see a time when we'll no longer have to put woman before director. It's true that this is a transition phase and we're obliged to insist, to prove, to make sure that there's somehow a minimum of equality. And while glitz and glamour may be back on the Côte d'Azur, the pandemic still gets top billing. Attendees will be tested for COVID every 48 hours and masked during screenings. Most of the famous after parties have been cancelled. Still, residents are just happy to have the stars back where they belong. Screenings run through July 14th with the festival's awards ceremony broadcast live on July 17th.